Hello, hello, and welcome back to the Valley Deal Farm, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to another. It's still Friday afternoon, so this is probably Sunday's video, but it's still Friday afternoon when I'm recording this. So let's we picked up the eggs. Let's see where the basketball is. Oh, wire. Oh, come on, come on. Behind the plant. Ah. Nothing. Okay, we need to go to the field. We have a couple of things we need to do today. Right, so uh, let's reset the head tracker. Yeah. Uh, we need to disconnect this one. We need to select this one. And we need to start loading these bales. We stacked them three high. Not sure if we're going to be able to transport them all. Let me just check. I can't see from in cab view. Oh, yeah, we have spikes here. Uh, let's stick to outside of the cab view and let's try to um, load them up. So we need to get these bales. This is our new uh, cow feed. Uh, we're going to use these bales. These are uh, canola, canola straw bales. Uh, we sold off in the last episode 24, I believe. Yes, I think it's... Uh, uh, I believe it was 24 straw bales. There we go. And that's this one, right? Yes. So, we sold off 24 uh, straw bales, uh, which we are role playing that the company is going to test them and uh, um, we might be able to create straw pellets for heating plant. Maybe next season, but sometimes in the future. If the tests are okay, then the company might open the heating plant themselves. We can sign a contract with them. We can do a lot of stuff concerning uh, the heating plant. But uh, we will see. We will see. Uh, let me unbuckle these. Uh, not that one, this one. Right, so in cab view, can we do this? I highly doubt it, but let's try. Okay, this looks like it's working. Right, okay, let's try to <coughs> negotiate a little bit to the left. Okay, uh, let's leave it here and now. Yes, this one. Right, this was next to perfect. Now we have an issue. Let me count how many bales we have here. We have, um, come on, one pile, two pile, three piles of bales plus one bale. And we can only fit two piles here plus one. So we have three bales extra. So we're going to ha probably have to stack them three high. Right. Um, uh, we're going to have to stack them three high, but we're going to have to... Oh, I know, I know. Uh, we're gonna have one load in the uh, inside uh, in the grab while we drive because we are just here around the corner from the farm, and uh, I think it's safer that than to load. Okay, this is not gonna be good. We need to go around 90 degrees to this. Right. Okay. What are we doing now? Oh wow. Well. Okay, a little help from a keyboard and a mouse, at least with this one single loose bale. Right, right, come on, come on, we can do this. There you go. Right, um, let's leave it like this. So, um, one, two, three. Right. Uh, in cap view. Let's try it. Right. Okay. Right. Now, 
Yeah, I, uh, as far as I read um, and uh, as far as my limited knowledge goes, um, the straw, the straw, the canola straw is quite good for. Uh, the um, canola straw is quite good for feeding or as a filler. Uh, when we make mixed rations, we would like to s we, because we have so much more cows now. We would like to spend a little less um, hay or silage uh, in the food mix. So let's see here. Uh, kind of okay. Well, it's still holding them. That's fine. And we have one more left there. Yeah, I don't know how legal is to drive the, with the bales spiked like this, but let's try. If we get stopped, we're going to promise to the officer, we know we're going to do it again. Okay, so let's unbuckle this. Right, okay, let's see how we did. Wow, <laughs> I'm really happy with this. Okay, we did really well. Wow, okay, so move the spikes. Can we fit here? No, no. E even if we push them. Let's test this. I'm actually really interested. I, I bet some of you are interested as well, but let's try this. Um, I'm not going to try to put bales in. I just want to see how much room we can get if we push all these bales forward. Uh, this is how all the ba bad plants start, you know. Hold my beer. Um, uh, let's try like this. If we go on this side, and if we do things like this, something like this, let's do it with that side panel it's gonna be faster a bit so we're trying to push the lower bale all the way forward okay that's it uh, we pushed it but no I don't think there's uh, enough room to force bales like vertically or horizontally or this way or that way so we're just gonna keep it like this and bring this back to the farm now we're gonna stick to this day uh, we're not gonna speed too much because we have a lot of work to do still uh, concerning harvest uh, we are only partial I'm, I'm just gonna no I don't have to drive down the field I'm pretty sure we don't have any bales left here uh, yeah, we have, uh, I believe, two barley fields um, still left um, that needs to be harvested. Oh, wheat field. Well, we have so much work to do. We have a lot of work to do, and it's going to be a lot of... Uh, let's see this. Spike it through. Well, this is good enough. Okay, now let's lift it. Let's... Yeah, this, this is pretty good. Right, this doesn't sound half as bad as I expected. Okay, let's connect this. Let's turn around really slowly because this is highly unstable. Um, now, the bales. Uh, let's check this out. Will they fit uh, next to each other like this? I think they will. We have to remember that this is food straw, not... Uh, oh, sorry. Select this one and this one. Oh. Now, let's start with the uh, front. Uh, yoink, yoink, and yoink. Let's do um, yeah. Let's do the first one with uh, like this and Y. See, they're not stuck. They're they're not grabbed in there by a script, but they are stuck because I pushed them. 
This is not good. Okay, let me do this. I probably should. Okay. Okay, lift up. Okay, here we go. Okay, I shouldn't be doing this, and guys, don't do this yourself because it's 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 not good. Um, naturally, how you put the bales in the trailer, leave them as that. Don't don't mess around with the trailer with the bales. Uh, I think a lot of people already mentioned this, uh, especially Dagger in his videos. Uh, bales tend to have their own physics. They break the law of normal physics, so they like to explode. They like to fly everywhere. Uh, I never experienced that myself, but I heard uh, Fridgar also said as well that um, bales are a pain to uh, handle uh, from time to time, so don't mess with the bales. For example, if you put uh, some auto-loading trailers, if you put a different size of the bales, it will fill them, it will recognize them, but you're not going to like the result. Um, for example, if you have a uh, 6,000 liter the HD bales, uh, they can actually uh, fit in as a normal square bales, but they're going to be so squeezed into each other. When you uh, unload the trailer, they can explode. They can just fly everywhere. So it's better not to mess about with that. Okay. Right. Um, okay, why? Okay, now this one is stuck, so I need to unbuckle. Well, that's gonna be enough. I just wanna keep one just in case they don't tip over for some weird reason. I'm not gonna question it, that's the order of things. Okay, so this is our fourth pile, for pillar, for straw load. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna stack them higher, obviously we can, and with great ease, but I'm gonna, not gonna stack them higher. We desperately need third tractor. We need a more powerful tractor, that's a fact. We can't... Oh, well. We can't mess about with two tractors, that's not enough. Um, yeah, so what about round bales? We're gonna need round... Oh, we have round straw bales for the bedding. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's good. And this one. And we have two left. Right. Okay, so this is this is gonna save us a lot of money because uh, we can sell the silage, extra silage, we can sell it to uh, biogas. So for now, as we have so many hay bales and we have straw bales and we're gonna have so, so much more straw bales because all this uh, wheat and barley straw, it's all gonna be um, baled. Uh, we will... All right. Yeah, we will be uh, selling some straw, uh, normal straw, to the customers, to the market. Whatever the price is, straight away, it's going to be 18 bales. This is our, uh, this one, that's our iron price. Right, uh, last one goes here. Let's unload this one. Now we um, we are kind of also it's not really role playing it's just me being probably stupid. Um, um, I I would like to harvest organic stuff first or green stuff first that we have uh, before we go because green stuff can be mixed if we have some leftover in a combine it can be mixed with a uh, other canola but. Uh, 
Uh, so f uh, usually I like to go to the north first and then do the south fields. So we're gonna do that uh, this time as well. But since we already harvested the uh, chemically fertilized canola, we're gonna also wash the harvester and the header. Or just the harvester, we'll see. Right, okay, so this one is done. The tractor doesn't look that bad, so I'm not gonna wash it. Uh, the weather looks really, really bad. Uh, j looks like it's gonna rain, but the weather forecast doesn't say so, doesn't think so. So uh, we're not gonna panic, we're not gonna do anything crazy for now. Uh, we're just gonna continue as it is. Okay, uh, animal time. So, what do we have here? Uh, cows. Oh, wow. Okay, this is a shocker. Oh, now you need everything. <laughs> Let's start with, uh, uh, what about the water? Water is so-so, but we're gonna need a water. Well, obviously we'll drink water. Okay. Mm. Since we don't have any silage bales left, or do we? I'm not sure. Let's do the straw first. Uh, I'm not gonna use a straw blower, I'm just gonna tip it in. Them. and this is the straw we're gonna use. I'm gonna use the upper one. Uh, right. Okay, but it only says base food 18%. Uh, is everything else over 20? I thought I'm gonna get the warning there for the cows. Okay. Now, I forgot if we can actually do this from here, or we have to go in behind the cows. Let's try it from here first. Yeah, we might have to go there. Let's check it out. Uh, yeah, that's a funny thing. Uh, usually I thought the episodes about... Um, Yard work would it's usually boring just feed the animals, clean the animals. But actually I, I like it now. There we go. Let's see if we can tip this bale in this way. Oh here we go. Awesome. Okay, that was nice. So straw full. Hay and grass. That's hay or grass. There we go. Uh, yeah, we're gonna use the the hay we have outside here. Oh, we have silage bales. Okay, fine. I, I think I'm gonna use those. I, I don't even know if the silage fermented yet. Um, we have this one, top one here. Right, do the sheep need... Uh, no, they don't. Second FK. Right, so sorry about that. Got a phone call. Even though I'm home work, I'm not working. Work related phone call. Okay, uh, so we have a lot more cows now because we bought a whole bunch of cows. Uh, they will require, I think, more than one. We're gonna stick to one because this is going to uh, fill them in pretty nicely check it out here's food okay let's check it right uh, yeah yeah I'm pretty happy with this so now we have uh, power food uh, power food we're gonna have to do yeah we have installed the, the mod you probably know if you watched previous episodes we have installed mod mo a mod that actually uh, prevents us from Ooh, we they're gonna get the new food they're gonna get new um, uh, canola straw now in the mixture. So we have a, a um, what's it I call it? A food mixer mod, which actually requires you. This is um, makes our life a little bit more difficult, but a little bit more fun. So the mod, what it does, 
Um, let's use the bill. Yoink. Okay. So, uh, mod uh, requires us on ho hard mode, like we are playing now, it requires us to run the mixer for one minute to mix the food. On easy, it's 15 seconds, on medium uh, or normal is. Uh, is only uh, one uh, 30 seconds and on hard it's one minute so we have to run the mixer connected to a tractor for one minute in order to mix the food which is extremely good and realistic and I totally approve this I love this one so it requires us to do a little bit more work it's not like fill everything in and it's fine and it's not like it's mixing now it's not mixing like on its own it, the pto has to be connected and you have to turn on the mixing wagon come on there we go and we're gonna use two hay all right where are you can we get two hay from at once Yoink. yes Oh. Wait. Come on, come on. Well, it's not meant to be. If it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be. That's the one by one. Okay. And I'm going to show you what I mean now. Um, I already showed you this, but I don't mind doing it again. Here we go. Um, this mixture should be really good, but we'll just recheck it just in case. Okay, so let's open up our dialog here. You see, it says 55 seconds. So you have to turn on the mixer, and on the left side, you see a counter down there, mixing time. So this is how long we have left until the uh, mix mixture is done. So we have uh, two hay bales, one silage bale, and one straw bale in this mixture. 32 seconds. Um, Hmm. Yeah, I wonder, does it mean that we can actually unload half of it? No, I don't. No, it actually doesn't count it as a uh, done mixture. You can see on the right hand side you have a grass uh, plus like um, a seed icon that's a. I think it's a leaf icon, so it's still fresh. It's not total mixed ration. It's not silage. It's not a TMR, sorry. But in six seconds, let's check it out. Bam! Right hand side, down there um, in the indicator, 16,000 liters of TMR. So, okay, let's do this. And let's check how it's progressing. Right, so we're gonna need more silage. Huh, I wonder if I put two silage bales in there, will it fill in silage a bit faster? That's an interesting point, actually. Right. Okay. This is continue filling both of them now. I think we're still gonna have to put uh, uh, one more uh, silage bale in. I should have uh, realistically spread this food around, but I was wondering how it's gonna fill it in. Right. Um, yeah, I think that's it. We still have water left, but I don't want to make this episode too long. Uh, but still, it has to be done. Okay. The one thing I didn't make make it work still. Uh, also, yeah, if you I cannot leave any total mix ration in the mixer because it rots after a few hours, so it has to be used or it's going to disappear. Okay, that's it. What else do we have? We can put one more silage bale in there. Water, 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 water is not fun. 
I wanted to say water is fine, but it's not. Who else needs water? Pigs, probably, yeah. Uh, pigs we're gonna do tomorrow, so we are not bothered by that. And the sheep are doing pretty well. Okay, let's, let's go like this first person view. Right, um, how do we drive with this front loader? I just drive like this because it seems that it's more com the most comfortable and doesn't um, prevent us from seeing properly. But uh, yeah, we can impale somebody. But on the other hand, we can cause more damage if we have an icon or just reload. Yes, we can cause more damage if we uh, can see properly and hit somebody. So we need around, okay, this should be enough. I don't want to use too much of this expensive water. I would like to give them a load of fresh water from the stream, even though I don't think that's extremely healthy because uh, the stream water sometimes can have bacteria in there, but yeah, so this one is a bit cleaner, but uh, I don't know. Right, uh, close it all, oh, stop here. Oh, and that's how burgers are made. Right, right, right. So yeah, this amount of cows gives us around, I believe. Okay, negotiate between them. Go, go, go. Good, good, good. Gives us around four thousand euros a day milk. Whoa, ghost cow. Wow, 215 liters left. Oh, okay. Yeah, we still have poo to clean. Okay, let's do that as well. Right, okay, let's uh, get out of here. Don't let the cows escape. Uh, enough. Murder. <laughs> That's how steaks are made. Closed. Yeah, this amount of cows should bring us a lot, a lot of uh, oh, oh, oh. reckless driving here. Jack marked it also. Mm. Right. Okay, first person. Let's get a poo draw, a uh, poo poo grab. Uh, yeah, and also what I want to do when we start using the. Okay, I forgot to unload the front fork. What I want to start doing uh, is using the silage fork. I think we have it. We should have it for our tractor, I believe. Uh, not to use the normal. Oh no. Uh, this one, yes. uh, so the silage cutter, the fork, from fork for silage, let's check it out here. So we have it in a store under, is it this one? No, this is manure fork. This one, silage cutter, yes, this one. It's only one and a half thousand liter capacity, but I don't care. It's it's what I want to use. Do they have it for a telehandler handler as well? For this one, probably not. They have this one, salvage fork. Mm. Probably one of those. Okay, what about the telehandlers? No, just one other one. Probably one of those. This is multi purpose. This one for everything, also. Nothing, that's it. Uh, yeah, actually, that's why that's one of the reasons also I would like to use it straight away. Okay. Right. Let's check it out. Where were we? Done already. 
You were mooing like you were properly hungry. Now it's done suddenly. Uh, uh, uh. Don't squish the poo. Okay, move yourself. Exactly. Yes, I'm happy. Come on, cow. Do do. Move, move. Okay, this one is good. Why did I close it? Okay, bail fork number three. Oh, we're done. You were yelling like there's more poo here. You tricked me. Okay, I'm not even gonna close this one. This is not gonna fall out. Right, right, right. There we go. Uh, oh, let me close this one. And off you go. We almost hit that bail there. And that's it guys, that's it for this episode. Uh, I forgot to turn it off. Now, if you liked this on it, uh, I hope you did. Press the like button, subscribe if you didn't. We still need to give water to the pigs. And one more bale, maybe silage. Actually, I wanna experiment with two silage bales next time. Um, 34 pigs, 38 cows, 35 sheep. Yes, we need to get this to 50 and then we're gonna stop with this one. We have liquid manure for a couple of um, uh, tankers. Manure, it's also for a couple of sprayings. That's nice. Uh, manure here, this is what we took out right now, so it's not updated. We should have around, uh, hmm, I don't know, around 8,000. Maybe. Anyway, <coughs> if you like this video, guys, please press the like button. If you didn't, uh, please comment in the comment section what would you like me to change, uh, what did you like, why did you didn't like. Um, ring the little bell icon that helps. You're gonna get the notifications every time we have an episode out, and that's every day. Uh, sometimes even more than once a day. Um, thank you for all your support. Thank you for everything that you do, guys. Have a nice weekend and see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.